modern. Well, good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's having a good Sunday. It's uh, Sunday, February 21st. And uh, I decided to get out here and uh, take a little walk with the, the little one. See if we can maybe scoop up a deer shed or two. And uh, I talked to a guy yesterday. He said all the deer he's been seeing have uh, shed their antlers. And uh, he's already picked up a couple. So we're, gonna, we're coming out here to where uh, Steph shot her buck last year. And we're just going to do a little bit of scouting and see if we can find a shed or two. And more than anything, just get out and enjoy the outdoors and go for a little walk, get a little exercise. Win, win, win all the all way across the board. So. We're gonna come up here and I don't know how far we'll go. We'll see how long she has. I got the backpack in case she gets tired. I can put her in, we got a few snacks and stuff, but won't stay out here all day, but stay out here for the majority of the morning. Got a, got the rifle just in case we see a coyote. And uh, I got headphones for her to put on so it doesn't hurt her ears. But the deer around here, they don't uh, migrate at all. So where they're typically at is where they hang out just all year long. They might move a little bit, a few miles, but nothing crazy. So if we find a deer shed and we find a good one, there's more likely he's hanging out here the whole fall. So we're gonna try to find them and see if we can find some beds and just see, learn, learn the area a little bit more. What do you see? Huh? What do you see? What are we looking for? You don't see nothing? All right, let's keep going. <sighs> well, we're uh, getting to the stopping point up on top of this ridge here. And uh, just taking a little break. We're 1.8 miles into the hike. And uh, she's doing great. Uh, me, I'm struggling. <laughs> but uh, this is the first time I put any type of load on my back, carrying anything. Uh, since my wife's deer in November Thanksgiving time frame, so I'm feeling it Definitely feel like uh, I should have been doing a little bit more heavier packing between now and then so got a lot of time till elk season so better time Start doing this more often that way. I'm ready and uh, not hurting like I am So, But I'm, po I'm powering through it. It's not that bad. So but we're probably gonna head up back towards the truck and it's been an hour and a half so we've hit a couple deer trails but not find anything so but it's been good to get out just get out and move around a little bit so it's been a good day so far can't beat these sunday views get up high see the ocean behind that knob is san clemente island you can see that She's ready to get going, so better catch up. Well, that's gonna do it for us uh, here on this Sunday. It was a good day. Good first hike of 2021. Uh, did just at three miles. So in two hours, a little over two hours is what we spent out there. Hit a couple deer trails, didn't find nothing, no sheds or nothing like that, so. But doesn't mean they weren't there. Just didn't get a good look at them. It's really green and pretty grown up around here because we got some good rain a couple weeks ago. So it's pretty thick, but didn't see no deer, but not really surprised. I wasn't expecting to see a whole lot or anything. So, but found a really good glass knob that I want to invest a little bit more time in too. So we'll have to see how that goes um, and everything like that. But she did amazing and uh, did awesome. and. I think we'll try to make this a, a weekly thing of getting out and you know exploring new areas and doing a little bit of scouting but more, more importantly just getting outside so but we're gonna head back to the house put her down for a nap and uh get everything together for the work week so back to the grind them all so thanks for watching and if uh we wrap up this video here i appreciate it and till next time hit that subscribe button so you stay with us Thank you.